representatives from charities including Stonewall and Young Minds. The event was convened by Heads Together, a mental health initiative headed by the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Harry said, there's too much negativity surrounding mental health and it must be so hard for young people to talk about it. Social media is more addictive than drugs and alcohol, and it's more dangerous because it's normalized and there are no restrictions to it. We are in quite a mind-altering time, but quite an exciting time, because everyone in this room has the opportunity to make a real difference. The Duke of Sussex added that the game Fortnite was irresponsible and should be banned. He said, a game like Fortnite for instance may not be so good for children. Parents have got their hands up, they don't know what to do about it. It's like waiting for the damage to be done and kids turning up on your doorsteps and families being broken down. Fortnite shouldn't be allowed. Where is the benefit in having that game in your household? It's created to addict an addiction to keep you in front of a computer for as long as possible. It's so irresponsible. In a post to the new Sussex Instagram account, a picture of Harry during the visit was shared, and he was quoted as saying, There continues to be huge progress in smashing the stigma that surrounds mental health, but let's keep normalizing the conversation. Let's keep reminding each other that it's okay to not be okay, and to listen to each other. After all, how we think determines how we act, how we feel, and how we treat ourselves and those around us. MCA South Ealing is part of the MCA Street Pauls Group, which provides services across London and is one of the largest in Europe. The association provides housing for 150 young people who are dealing with a range of problems such as homelessness, mental illness, substance misuse and domestic violence. Earlier in the afternoon, Harry spoke with three residents at the MCA, Jade Messa Good Enough, Julie Spencer and Rory Tomlinson. He told them, one of the most comforting things to know is you're not alone and you're one of the more as opposed to one of the few. Your own experience is very unique to you but the relatability of people in this place and everybody outside is huge. It's hugely relatable, even more so today than it was four years ago. Elsewhere during the tour he discussed the Sharp M whole campaign with Young Champions for Mental Health. The campaign, developed by the NHS and MCA, encourages young people to speak openly about their mental health issues. Harry finished with a ballet demonstration by a group of children between the ages of four and six, during which he tested his balance in a short exercise. What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to get instant news update.